wear your best stuff because his cousin gonna be out of there. Mm -hmm. It is the over sexualization that I be trying to say on the channel and people be trying to say like I'm a fruitcake in the mountains. Like, yo, you up there smelling flowers and fresh air. When did that be a bad thing? I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Have you ever smelt? First of all, you ever been on 84 in, uh, in Oregon? On that 84 lead over to Portland? Of course. They're talking about coming out of... Uh, you got to come out of Idaho. Yeah, you, you come out of Idaho. You go up 82 to you know, 84. Past the pilot, come down out of that And then you mountain. just follow in the water between Idaho and Washington all the way to Portland. Yes. And it is. Listen, bro, it is you gorgeous. Cross over into Washington. Cross oh, the right over there. It's a couple yeah. bridges that they get you to Washington. You talking about the Dolls, Dolls? Uh, all of that, that. Dolls, Dallas, the Mahana. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. I'm saying that wrong. Waterfalls. Yeah. That, I actually just that, that river that separates Oregon from Washington. Exactly. Yeah. Beautiful. And, and I love it. Is is they got houses and neighbor and communities spackled all the way across mm -hmm. that joint. Mm -hmm. All the way across it. And then when I'm driving that thing, it is emotional because it's like <sighs> we look at that on a IG. Hashtag. Right. It's like you're driving through the IG hashtag of RV life. Right. And right. when we talk to people where we from, they go into the, the Hennessy Festival. Yeah. Yeah. Like they don't get it. The watermelon festivals this weekend. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, literally, we have a watermelon festival. It's a oodles and noodles is, but... get together. It's a, it's a noodles get I, I put ketchup in my noodles. And like, what are we doing? And it gets to the point where I, I don't even want to try to teach people anymore because all it does is make people hate me. Right. But it's like the problem is I'm a free. I can I think freely. I don't think of and they'll be like, well, you know, you don't understand because you're not from the streets. Nothing about me tells you I'm from the streets, but I am from Norfolk, Virginia. So to say I'm not from the streets is just not factual. But I was smart enough to think past it. Yeah. I'm not about to go by no Escalade, bro. And I'm approved for it. That's the sad part. BMW yeah. called me every two months. You can get a 745 for 890 a week. Like, what are we doing? And I was a late bloomer with all that kind of stuff. Like, I was stuck in stuffing money in the mattress and the shoebox. You know, just living and acting. And I'm going to say acting just because now that I've opened myself up to other things, I can't per se say that was me. That just was, I guess, me moving in the parameters of where I was or in, in interacting with the people that was around me. But that didn't, um, that wasn't, I don't think, a reflection of, I guess, the real person that I am. Mm -hmm. I kind of was just working within the confines of what I was in. You were working within the confines of your miseducation. Yeah, in fact. So now that I, like I said, can step back and look, I can see the error everywhere, and I'm, I'm blessed, dog. Huh? Like beyond the fact that you don't even need that. Gee, the fact How? that I'm alive, like blessed, G. Like real talk, like, and I don't even talk blessings, and that ain't even yeah. my names, but just the fact of even being that, that here, you made putting it to myself 84. in so many situations that could have straight went. Left and for whatever reason, and you can't say what the reason was. It's just just ignorance, bro. Yeah, I mean, something as simple as I remember spinning out on the highway one time in the van, hydroplane. I spun around like three or four times. I seen traffic, forward, seen it again, forward, seen it again. Ended up on the shoulder of the highway. Like the van literally was. I couldn't even open my. The van was scraping the median on the inside of ninety five, right there coming through Richmond. Mm -hmm. Three or four lanes of highway. I spun out like three times in a circle and ended up stopped and literally facing the direction that I was originally going and up against the median out of traffic. Like I didn't spin out and stop in the middle of the highway. Like I literally stopped what were you on the shoulder and I wanted to make, control it. What, did make, what were you doing to make you lose control? A hydroplane, speeding, probably not being thinking. a homeboy in, in a truck, in, in, in a truck vibing and whipping. In the rain, and came around the bend, around the highway, and that joint. Not paying attention. And next thing you know, all I, I mean, it was silent, because he didn't scream, I didn't scream. Oh, we yeah, that's shock nothing. right there. <laughs> and, bro, we stopped, boom. I looked over at him, he looked at me. All he did was grab his cigarette out of the pack 
and sparked his joint right there. We sitting on the shoulder in the highway and he's just smoking. And I'm just like, yo, what just happened? Like, this could have went ugly. Oh, I mean, and that's, I guess, basic stuff, but we talking shootings and, and just wild regular. Well, we consider it to be regular. Yo, we we really think it's regular. regular. That's what I'm saying. That's say. not normal at all. No, it's not normal, bro, to be literally watching your back from because a uh, hood retaliating over something that happened three days ago that might not even have nothing to do with you. Or being making sure you're around certain people just because you know it's dangerous to be around certain people. So you'll stay away from that because you never know what's going to come their way because you don't know what type of stuff they're into. So you interacting with people who... When at the end of the day, you could have just got on the bus and left. Yeah. That's the thing. But I didn't. It, it's, it's, the, it's the prison with no walls. They say the strongest prison on the planet is one with no walls. Like, if you go to our hood, no one tell them they can't leave. So when they see you, oh, man, how you get into that? I called. Yeah. You can leave. And then some, I know dudes in the hood got nothing on their record. Perfect driving school. Just ain't leaving. I'm like, bro, why don't you why don't you try this? Nah, B, I can't do that joint you do. Yes, you can, bro. I can't drive that long. Like, bro, I remember I used to say stuff like that. Like, I can't, I can't drive to Atlanta. That's too far. I gotta fly. I can't drive that far. But I mean, it's just like anything else. It's 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 a muscle. It's a it's a training that you almost put yourself through to be able to drive long distance. I mean, nobody just jumps out and, and drives a 10 hour shift straight like that or 10, 12 hours of no. drive. It's, 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 it's abnormal. Yeah, you have to, it's like doing time. You gotta learn how to do time. Yes. You gotta know yeah. how to sit there for 11 hours yeah. and pull 700 something miles. So I, when I'm on the road, like, I think of family and I think of friends and I think of stuff like that. But at the same time, I don't dwell there. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't. I don't. You're stay not romanticizing. There. About I don't it. leave and can't wait to get back. No. I don't view it like that. No. Like I literally live on the road. I don't own a car, bro. I just spent twenty two hundred dollars on a rental car for two weeks. I rented a, 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 a Beamer, kept it for twelve days or however long we had it. And gave it right on 2, back. Twenty two hundred. Here y'all go. I'm gone. Good luck with them transmission problems. <laughs> Because I don't ran you. I don't so. But yeah, like literally, bro. I, and I'm cool with it. Now, I mean, I, could I just went ahead and cop the Honda or something? But then I got to worry about, I, I, I'm not into I don't want to do all that right now. I'm not. It's not where you are. You yeah, no. Because when I get a whip, when I get one, it's going to be. What you want. Yeah. Bar none. You know my, fa- you know my the number one whip I want right now. A Subaru Outback. <laughs> and I, and see, you I see, now, now you, Subaru Outback. you know how when you talk Outback. to a hood nigga, they laugh at you. I, you know I, I, mean? I get the, I right. get it. No, 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 you don't. But it, it ain't my style. You wouldn't laugh. It ain't my style, technically, because I'm a Benz nigga for real. Hey, fact. You know, I, 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 had the, I had the Benzos back before Lorenzo, so we ain't even got the, and I had the M4 joint, the V8 SUV, all wheel drive. We ain't even gonna get in all that because nobody else understand that. But the point is this: silver joint, mahogany wood. But Man, the point is this: I had a navy. We ain't gonna talk about that. <laughs> it's, all, it's all love. It's Continue. all love. Silver's a better color. But what I'm saying is, I get the freedom of the car. I get the freedom. Of, like I drove. I did a photography retreat. Got me an Outback, 2013. I went off road with the joint. Went back and seen plantation fields on the coast of different farmers mm. just did like 30 miles was just where just the, the city just left and it was just <sighs> like I was in a new world car mm. handled it did all that at 28 miles a gallon I have mm. room for storage the car oh, we'll first of all police don't even see Subaru no they're like invisible basically I'm driving through places get back and it's like, I get why this car is everywhere out here. But why in my heart, and this is where the problem comes in, why do in my heart do I want a lima bean green beans? This is the miseducation. It's like, why? Because when I think about it, I can't take the beans back here. Well, 
You cannot take no rear wheel drive bins back here. Right. I'm too big for the little coupe, John. So now I'm uncomfortable getting in that of them. The attraction that it brings to me is negative. It brings negative women. It brings negative shit from people around me. It's assumptions of what I am. It's a bitch to fix. Why do I want this car? Because it does not fit my lifestyle and what I profess that I want. I want a cabin somewhere, do photography, chill, run the track rails. Then why the fuck do I want a Benz that's two inches off the ground? Because the, the jigaboo and Jean is always bubbling up like, I'm putting 20 folds on it, bitch. Like, I'm just going to do it. The jigaboo Jean. The, you don't think the jigaboo Jean is there. Me and you, when we see a dope car, we automatically assess what size rims can go on. It. We just know. Yeah. We don't need to go to no rim shop. Oh, you can't put 22s on it. Mm. We not know. With, not without cutting the hood <laughs> or something. Cutting the wheel wheel and putting blocks on Why do we know this? When we could just have a Subaru Outback, not be harassed, better fuel mileage, better everything, and live the life that we're professing that we want. That's how you know it's like in the genetic code. To, it's the Cadillac gene. But is, is it just the gene or, 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 or just overall style, period? Like, because I mean, there's nothing wrong to me. To me. Being able to have nice things, I don't. It, it, it's it's some within the. I think it's just in the soul of us. Period. Now, it may be redirected into some basic material stuff like certain types of cars and stuff like that. But that may go back to the. Could that go back to the 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 the, 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 the king queen? No. Type of element no. of 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 that. It is us being in a place where we have systemically been out of class, and us purchasing our class. When you go see the Vanderbilts, they don't drive Benzes, bro, because they're actually in that class. You hear me? That's why they say they know new money and old money. You go overseas and shit, stuff, and, and they drive taxi cabs as Benzes. Your boy Warren Buffett, his his daughter. I seen an article. Cause he riding around in an old caddy. Right? Not no more, cause she argued him down before he finally had to buy another one. So he go to the Cadillac dealership and buy a seven year old one. Cause to him, it was a tool. What does it mean? It was a tool to get from his meeting to the next meeting. It's, that's what I'm trying to tell you. What I'm saying is the lifestyle that me and you say we like. Oh, the Pacific. This and that. A, a, a Mercedes C three five hundred has no business riding those rails. But we still kind of want it because it's almost like a, it's just a, it's hard. Like yeah. we just, I just got to have it. Right. Just to I, get I, it and never drive it because it can't go where you going. And that's $80,000. It's, it's a feeling. I don't think you got, it don't have to be that car to get it, but it's a feeling. It's, 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 it's engineering. It's, it's, I think, I mean, for those who are into cars. You, you, there's certain handling, certain curves, you know what I mean? There's, there's, mm. there's a certain feeling, the, yeah. the power of it and all that. But yeah. I, I definitely get it. It is definitely the overall, feeling that, not, pe it is the feeling and the quasi respect that you get from having the car. It's the, ooh, that joint mean. It's the women looking. It's, it's the status symbol of it. And the thing, why, how you know it's an addiction because the status symbol only lasts until the shape changes. Okay. So now you keep rebuying it. So it's it's a hook. It's 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 a it's a new one just came. The out. new one just came out. The so bug now, eye being the, now you got to get the bug the eye. The bubble eye joint with the kit. You heard, baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got yeah. to get that one. When really the W series, the box joints was really the hottest right. one. W uh, one forty, I think. One. But but at, at at the same time, you you now you're stuck in a culture where you keep reallocating your finances to something that brings you no value except for fictitious. It's, it's a feeling that you get, but you can't build wealth with the joint. Right. You can't, you're, oh, I want a good woman. You ain't pulling a lot of good women with a C3 Benz, dog. You're not. Hmm. Number one, a lot of good women won't even get in the car. Like that is too, that's like tacky gaudy. Right. Why am I getting in this car where the, where the pipes glow when you go fast? Like, that's ridiculous. They're not getting in that car. <laughs> so you're not looking for a good woman. You're going to attract what? You've had a nice car before, right? Yeah. The majority, not all. What did you attract to that nice car? The mind state that was attracted to it? A person that wants to be seen. 
which is not the person who is normally wholesome. Now, would you trust that person not to unplug you if you got sick? Would you trust her cooking for you? Can she cook? Right. <sighs> can you can you stay in that person long after you screw them for long periods of time? No, they're annoying. Very much. Oh, well, damn, much. you know what? Uh, the new shape came out. TV got the new one. You ain't got a new one. Like, you want to deal with that shit? Like, who wants to deal with that? I remember telling my wife that, like, like, I don't know why, but you know what really pissed me off? And I felt that strange. Like, I could be around you and you don't really annoy the holy fuck yeah, out of me. And you don't. Like, there must be something about you or, or something because you're still here and I don't really want you to leave like that. I ain't say I don't want you to leave at all. And this was a long time ago. Long, yeah. long, 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 long time ago. But I can deal with you. You know what I mean? Like this is cool. I don't. I don't. I don't want you to leave like that. Yeah, because we can have a sweatpants day. Mm. I'm not putting on shell toe Adidas and and a gold chain and fronts in my mouth to go to the movie, bro. I'm not doing it. Let me tell you something. In my mind, I'm 57 years old. I know. I'm dressed. If I can't wear this where we going, we ain't going. I just don't. I I, I do. Man, I got in the elevator once. About two years ago. So I'm 33. Young bucks get in being rowdy. Fuck that nigga. You know, you know, he had a They look at me. Oh, excuse me, sir. I'm like, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, I'm man. looking at then he turned around like I was somebody uncle, like just and they kept it together until they got off the elevator. I'm like, I'm a sir? When the fuck that happened? When you put them crocs on, bro. <laughs> Two things I realized. Yeah, I, get it. I was happy I'm not in the category no more. To yeah. me, it was like, I can literally wear anything I want. I'm grown. I'm right. a grown ass man, dog. Like, yeah. I'm not putting on skinny jeans and booty, but I'm not doing none of that, bro. Right. I don't yeah. have to do that. Because what's valuable about me is not a, a Italian designer. That's what I mean by the jigaboo gene. These fools is protesting, and then the writers <laughs> going and is stealing, stealing shit out of Gucci. While the protesters are trying to, it's just jigabooing, bro. It's stupid. Well, I just I like Gucci clothes. You don't just like anything in this world. It's called programming. Me and you like Benzes because we was looking at fools and TV shows and movies where the person of power and status had what a right. Benz. So we like Benzes. First of all, Benzes and big is ones, big. not just a regular Benz. How big can you, you make can it? The little joint. I want the big one with the extended back door. Like, I want the biggest one possible. Yes. So technically, we drive in limos. I say it was nothing that pissed me off too. Is that why we own niggas? Why the fuck is niggas buying phantoms and driving them? It's a fucking limo. Yeah, All the good shit to, in the back. Yeah. You're supposed to have a driver. What do you think old money is thinking when they see your nigga ass driving by? And it's like driving a stretch limo in the 80s. And right. you in the front. Everybody get in. Like, it's stupid. Yeah, I agree. That's a fact. Oh, it pissed me off, bro. Yeah, the, 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 the what's it called? Uh, Callan, what's the, what's the, what's the, uh, the, the Rolls Royce truck? Callahan, Callahan. I don't even know the name, but them don't say it's hard, though. Yeah, they hard. But $480,000? The back seat is where, like you said, it's where you're supposed to be. It's a limo. That's why Man. when we used to watch Richie Rich and everything, and yeah. he pulled up in the little Silver Star limo, did he get out the front? Right. No! But yeah. niggas are so jigabooing, they'll buy the limo and can't afford the 100000 a year shit for the driver. Or, they don't know you ain't supposed to drive it. Right. Yeah. They just yeah. don't know. That comes with what? Class, which means you cannot buy your class. Just like you can't buy your style. You can be rich no. as fuck and be tacky. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Money don't buy you none of that. You be in them you Kanye holy shit. shirts. Yeah, it's plenty of cornballs with bread. Plenty of them. You in them Kanye holy shirts like your grandma draws and shit, and you walking up and down that shit talking about something that's high fashion. But they easy, though. No. Oh, niggas get on my nerve, bro. Yeah. But I have stuff that I like. I, I, and I don't know. There you go crossing the fence. No, I'm just saying we're talking about life and being able to experience and do things and experience different things. Now, you're going to be influenced by all types of stuff. Mm -hmm. I, I get all that. I get right. the programming of it and all of that. But I still enjoy. It's like a certain type of food. Could you eat the same thing every day and mm -hmm. live mm -hmm. and all of that? You could. 
Mm-hmm. Well, no, you can't. I mean, you physically, yes. 